Hi everyone, this is Delphine here. How are you doing? Well, here I'm doing well. And today I want to talk to you about four ways to keep the, the other people energy that you don't need away from yourself. First of all, try to learn how to say no when someone is asking you for a favor. Not saying that you have to say no all the time, but sometimes have you felt like, oh, I, I wish I could help them, but I'm feeling so not ready for it yet, or I am not having the most beautiful energy at this point to do that, or I'm myself exhausted, I need help, but you're doing it anyways, because you've been raised a way that if you want to show love to someone or if you want to receive love from someone, you have to please that person. Or so this is how your mental works or this is how you have been brought up by your parents or at school. Be a sweetheart. Do this for me, please. Have you heard that before? Yes, you're one of the pleaser and you're doing it to please your people so you can be loved and love in return. Well, stop doing that all over the place. Respect yourself, respect your sanity, respect your health, put some boundaries, learn how to say no nicely, but learn at least just for your own sanity. Second, this is from my teacher in France who did his whole thesis on energy vampires. Have you ever met someone that is completely out of energy and they're like grumpy or not, they're not feeling good? But you're doing good, and after the conversation, it kind of switched. You're not feeling good, and that person's feeling good. These people are energy vampires. You want to just be aware of who they are in your surroundings, just to make sure that when you're going to meet them, you know that you need to set that boundary so they don't take your energy. Try to be aware of that is number one. First step to not be vampired, vampirized, I don't know how to say it by this other person. Third, when you feel like you are really cannot take it anymore, you go back to nature. How does it feel to just walk on the sand or walk in on the grass or walk out, walk out there in the mountain if you have mountain? Like whatever you can do, try to go out there in nature and reset yourself. I personally because it's so hot here in the summer, I only go at night outside and I look at stars and I'm just projecting myself into up like the universe and thinking, okay, this is nice to be part of this bigger plan and okay, I'm gonna release every single tension I have and I'm gonna just reset my energy and think more clearly now just before going to bed, for example, you know, just reset renew like you know on your computer sometimes you do have to restart your computer well same for yourself just reset and nature will do it now the fourth one is about being responsible for your choices for example if you change your vocabulary vocabulary to from i have to do this today to i choose to do this today did you feel the difference in terms of energy? I have to do that today. Oh, again, I should do this, really, I know, but oh, I just don't wanna do it. But how about you change that to, well, not that I love doing that, but I choose to take the time to do it because this needs to be done no matter what, and I'm gonna choose to do it with fun because no matter what you do with fun, it will be successful and a lot more uh, enjoyable and probably with better results as well. So, four, stop pleasing people, learn how to say no. Um, go in nature, that was third, that's okay. Go in nature to restart, reset. Block energy, block people that are taking your energy down. You know what I mean? Like the energy vampires out or block them. Like use any sort of visualization of like, okay, I actually, this person is not going to come into my territory and not going to take my energy. I am in full energy. This is going to be this way. You know, intention, intention helps. And force, be responsible for your life, for your choices. You 
are the responsible. I will do a video, full video, on this responsibility matter because I think this is really important. But for now, this is for the are these are four little tips for you to keep your energy from going away for different reason. So I will do more videos probably on this responsive on being responsible for our life later on. But in the meanwhile, I will see you in another video, another week. And until then, be happy, be well, be you.